What up, y'all? I'm Mike, and this is The Potential, and y'all, Normani's coming. She's coming. Normani's coming. She's coming. Normani's coming. She's coming. Normani's coming. She's coming. Shout out to the beautiful. I want to call her the princess of R&B, but I really can't go that crazy because the album ain't came out yet. But when the album do come out, then I'm going to still call her the princess of R&B because I already know it's going to be good. Y'all know it's going to be great. So we're going to put her crown over here. And when she drop and we get our life, then we're going to give her her crown because she is a princess of R&B. I love Normani. Shout out to New Orleans East. Normani has been prepping for her debut album for a very long time. I think she didn't even start it over a couple of times, but we're not going to get into all of that. We're just going to take a trip down memory lane and get into all of the little snippets and dippets and crippets and sippets and mippets that we've heard along the way. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share. Hit the notification bell one time. Okay, y'all, my nerves bad because I didn't hear some snippets, but I don't know what to expect. I'm scared. Okay, y'all. So this one is called Gold and Entertaining. If you never heard these, gag with me. What? That's it. Y'all, this one don't even have a name. No, Mani's bright, the brightness in her voice is, oh, that's what I'm really excited about. Wait, that's not enough. Y'all. Y'all, we heard. We heard this one before. This, we want this one. Wait. Okay, wait. I never heard. Wait. Y'all, I'm excited to know how many of these songs or like sounds, because a lot of them are sounds like instrumentals. And I wonder how many we're going to actually hear on the album. That That's the part that's like super, super cringe. It's like, oh, that who did, but who did. That one had, no money, no money. That one has to go on the album. It has to. It has to. <laughs> Now that's the one where she was recording um in a studio with Big Frida. That has to go on the album. New Orleans. Okay, that was a couple of snippets, a couple of sounds. We all just so excited from the mind and we over here gagging over snippets. It's crazy. Oh, y'all, this this one is Golden Entertainer. I think it's longer. Source, 
That one sound real good. Okay, and we all know, we all heard this before, but let's listen to it anyway because we're having a good time. <laughs> Y'all, let's just say one more time. That sound is so good, but I have a question. Do y'all want Wild Side to be on the album? I kind of do, because from a stand point of view, I think it's gonna, it should help with the sales of the album, technically, because it's a part of the album. Do y'all want Wild Side on the album? Y'all, this the, okay, this the new one, hold on. Uh-oh, it's not playing, uh-oh. Refresh, uh-oh. <laughs> is i mean i guess we haven't heard enough of it to know what the name of the song is but y'all do y'all want the name of the album be called dear 22 why would she write that 2022 and just a little inside if y'all didn't know y'all know the girl group from back in the day cherish they had two twins felicia and fallon felicia wrote the new song that we heard when the mind was in the car felicia wrote that song shout out to felicia period so y'all already know, when stuff happens with Normani, we're going to get into it on this channel. But until then, if you want to become a part of the posse, make sure you write down in the comments below and let me know what else you want me to react to. And always remember, on the other side of fear is greatness. Stop being scared and just do it. My name is Mike and this is The Potential.